Hi everybody, welcome back. It's Tuesday, March 17th. Um, happy St. Patrick's Day. I'm wearing my green on this cold and snowy day. Um, and today I'm actually going to read a poem by one of my favorite Irish poets, Seamus Haney. Um, but first, um, I am going to read a poem, um, a Shel Silverstein poem for um, some of my friends out there, um, particularly my friends in Brentwood, who I heard really like Shel Silverstein. So um, let's get started. Um, here we have Adventures of a Frisbee. And this is from Shel Silverstein's book, A Light in the Attic. The Frisbee. He got tired of sailing to and fro and to and thought about the other things that he might like to do. So the next time that they threw him, he turned there in the sky and sailed away to try and find some new things he could try. He tried to be an eyeglass, but no one could see through him. He tried to be a UFO, but everybody knew him. He tried to be a dinner plate, but he got cracked and quit. He tried to be a pizza, but he got tossed and baked and bit. He tried to be a hubcap, but the cars all moved too quick. He tried to be a record, but the spinning made him sick. He tried to be a quarter, but he was too big to spend. So he rolled home quite glad to be a Frisbee once again. So that's to some of my younger friends in the Sparhawk community. Um, so here we have, um, this is actually from um, Seamus Haney's Collected Works, Open Ground. Um, really remarkable poet, Nobel Prize winner. Um, and in honor of Ireland um, today, um, I thought I would read um, a, a poem by him that I really love um, called Mint. Um, and, and I think that it, you know, it talks a little bit about life kind of finding a way regardless of um, what's all around it. So um, this is Seamus Haney's poem, Mint. It looked like a clump of small dusty nettles growing wild at the gable of the house beyond where we dumped our refuse and old bottles. Unverdant ever, almost beneath notice. But to be fair, it also smelled promise and newness in the backyard of our life as if something callow yet tenacious sauntered in green alleys and grew rife. The snip of scissor blades, the light of Sunday mornings when the mint was cut and loved, my last things will be first things slipping from me. Yet let all things go free that have survived. Let the smells of mint go heady and defenseless like inmates liberated in that yard, like the disregarded ones we turned against because we'd failed them by our disregard. So a little bit of Irish poetry today. Um, hope everyone is doing well. I know it's a little bit cold and snowy, but um, try to get out in your backyards today and get some fresh air. Um, know that I'm thinking about all of you and sending, again, lots of love. All right, take care. Bye. See you tomorrow.